Hello Internet, my name is Aaron Garcia and today I am making a video and this is a special shout out to Andrew. You know who you are and you know why I'm making a shout out video to you. Um, it's because you said something about my beard and that I didn't do enough unboxing videos or I haven't done one lately. That's probably what you said. You haven't done an unboxing video lately and I'm going to fix both of those things, my beard and the unboxing. So. Uh, I'm going to give you the biggest unboxing, unbagging, mystery, Amazon shopping spree that you've ever seen or that I can possibly give you. So, I have a lot. That's all. <laughs> that sounded expensive because <laughs> it was. Uh, we're going to, we've got lots of packages for you, okay? I mean, if that's not enough for you, we've got bags and boxes and yeah we're, we're ready okay this is gonna be a great video you're gonna be entertained by the end of it so and I also want to say before I f forget to say so that uh, Jeff Bezos the guy of you know founder of Amazon I just want you to know that you can thank me for your Amazon Beverly Hillbillies mansion because uh, I am quite devoted to your product or your service. So, um, yes, I am responsible for that one kitchen tile that's by the corner, by your refrigerator. I want to take credit for that tile, if there's tile in there. I'm taking credit for that one tile of all my Amazon purchases. So you can thank me. And if uh, my viewers are watching out there, please share this video of Jeff Bezos. I want to at least get a chuckle out of him. I want 30 seconds of chuckle and maybe a comment. I mean, you know, we've all kind of supported him with all these Amazon purchases. We have an addiction, so obviously we have a problem, and this is helping him out. So, one of these bags has to do with my beard, and it's not that one. Ah, uh, it's, this feels, yes. So, I have a feeling it's this one. Uh, basically, I haven't shaven in a while because, well, I haven't shaven since the weekend, because my razor broke. And um, to fix that, I decided to get a razor. That was the logical choice, and I found this very nice budget one for, uh, I think, 22 bucks. It's by Wall, and here it is. Oh yeah, look at that. Throw that away, because we need to keep track of what bags we're on. Um, yeah, this is the Wall Clipper. And uh, the Wall Clipper Corporation, and if I use this product, I will look just like this guy right here. I will have a clean, s silky smooth face, and probably <laughs> a serious expression. <laughs> uh, this is actually pretty nice packaging, because usually when I buy a Wall um, product, uh, it comes. I usually go to HEB and buy it. And uh, this time I bought it on Amazon. Well, no, that's not true. The first time I bought it at HEB, the second two, the, the last two times, including this one, I bought it from Amazon. And you get it in a little plastic package, and you rip it out, and it shows you what it is. This is kind of cool, actually. So I don't know if the, the main camera. Okay, my my backup camera is getting this. Uh, this is a um, nice brown box. It says it was uh, the professional brand used by uh, the brand used by professionals since 1919, and they even have this face here that looks like about that time period. Actually, no, I'm not entirely sure what year that is. Maybe that's the founder or the inventor or whatever. But anyway, I got this, and it's gonna fix my face not being shaven. I'm excited. So. Uh, let's open this up and see what it's about because we got a lot of packages to go see and this is just one of them uh, This is probably the most exciting one to mr. Andrew um, Ooh, Well, let's let's enjoy this so uh, In this kit you will find a rechargeable beard trimmer battery nose and ear detailer three stubble guide combs four beard guide combs six position adjustable guide comb uh, charger, beard comb, cleaning brush, blade oil, I didn't know you needed that, trimming, a trimmer blade guard, protective detailer cap, travel case, English and Spanish instructions, and styling guide, because I need to style. So, yeah, this is, this is cool. I needed this. 
So I'm actually really enthusiastic about this product uh, because I need it. Um, wall satisfaction guarantee, thank you for purchasing, thank you for your purchase. For nearly 100 years, Wall has been providing quality products. We want you to be delighted. Our goal is to earn your highest rating. Okay, so I'm definitely going back on Amazon and hitting my five-star rating. If you are frustrated in any way with our product, please let us know, and we will do everything in our power to make it right. You have our guarantee. And there's an email address, a phone number, and a website to visit. So, ooh, ooh, wow, this is fun. I should have saved this to the end. This is... This is like a three-part box unboxing part. So we got accessories, we got storage, we got a trimmer. So let's start with the storage. It's the biggest box in here. Uh, it's this nice box with a little black stripe, and I want to just let you see that. Look at that. This is pretty cool. I, I was actually, when I bought this, and Andrew made the comment that um, you should unbox your shaver, uh, I was thinking it's going to come in a plastic, you know, one of those things where you already kind of see everything that's in there and you cut it off with scissors. This is actually a different experience than what I was anticipating. Uh, it's coming in this little box. It's got this little nice glossy stripe on it. And, ooh, look at that. And, of course, I always sniff the box, right? It just smells like black paper. But uh, this is the accessory. This is a storage. What is it? Okay. Oh, 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 look at this, some shiny gizmo. It's the uh, nose trimmer. Uh, let's see what it says it is. It is the battery ear and nose detailer. So, uh, and it can be wet or dry. So I guess it can function either way. Quite nice, it's very light and silver, and I like it. Very, very nice. Okay, we'll put that back in the bag. And there is a storage pouch in here. Ooh, it's got a beard guide. Operating instructions for battery trimmer, rechargeable, blah, blah, blah. Okay, and it folds out like a map, which is awesome. And I'm totally gonna read this side because it's not in a language I understand. So. Flipping over, uh, here's the English side, and it tells me how to clean and store the six position guide, growing a beard, trimming and edging your beard, a bunch of things I probably should read, and how to service and repair your wall charger. So if I had read this on my last one, I probably would have gotten it serviced, but I didn't, so I bought a new one. So I'm not sure if that's a good or bad thing. but. It gives me something to unbox. And let's see what storage pouch I got. Ooh, look at this. So I know what Andrew's saying in the background right now. He's like, come on, Aaron, it's a shaver. Uh, you're right, Andrew, it's a shaver, but I'm enjoying it. This is very nice. And I am actually curious to know, because he did make a comment that, okay, there's no battery in here. That's why it doesn't turn on. I'd be like, ooh, it's charged, bonus points. So let's keep looking at this. And, okay. I don't know how much this camera's getting over there. Okay. Yeah, it's got a nice dual compartment storage bag. Very nice touch. Definitely gonna use that. Uh, Accessories, we're on to accessories. Ooh. More shiny glossiness, and it says accessories at the top very nicely. Make sure the other camera gets that. Very nice, let's open it up. And these are all the guides and whatever else. A uh, little beard guide comb, some oil. It's nice and sealed and hygienic like it um charging cable very light just like i remember very good so uh what i have here are two different i don't know if you saw that in the picture but i've, I've got a ear and nose detailer and i've got a beard trimmer 
and it comes as a set. Uh, all for 22 bucks, if I remember correctly. I will put that up on the screen and a link in the description below um, if you're interested, because this is a great deal. I've heard very good things about wall, and in fact, I've owned two walls. I think I'm pronouncing that right. Um, yeah, I really like this product. It works very well, so that's why I bought a third one. Uh, the only reason I bought a new one is because I've had the other ones for years, and uh, I used them until they died and maybe failed to read the f part that I could have it serviced. But I was like, yeah, that's no fun. We can just buy a new one. So uh, that's what I did. So now for the trimmer. This is, this is why we're really here. This is what's going to fix my face so I can be sh cleanly shaven. Yes. Uh, look at this. Ooh, very nice. It's silver, it's very nice. And let's see if it's pre-charged. Very nice, I'm not gonna shave right now because I'll make a mess. But yes, it is pre-charged and that is bonus points. Definitely bonus points and I lost a little clip that goes on top of it already. Oh, there it is. So, yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Already pre-shaven, uh, pre-shaven, pre-charged. Already pre-charged, I like that. Very, very nice. Shiny, light, looks good. Uh, the one thing I don't see in this set that my other one provided me with was a stand. You could set it up in a stand, but you get a bag. So I'm not sure if this was intended to be like a travel set, or whatever but it's nice I like it and I'm definitely gonna use this later uh, we'll decide if it's gonna be in the video or not uh, moving on to the next products we have because I said I was gonna give you the biggest unboxing experience ever so let's just set that off to the side this is fun it's like Christmas but in September so it's no special holiday just decided to buy a bunch of random things this. This seems like something I want to open. Should have brought scissors. Don't know why I didn't. Knife will do. So, uh, you might be wondering why I have all these packages. And this next package is going to give you a big clue to why. Um, yes, I like Amazon a lot. But, ooh. This book, this is a book, believe it or not, uh, will give you a very big clue to why there's so many boxes. Oh yes. This is not the wedding registry. This is uh, my wedding sponsoring Amazon. It's not the other way around. I wish Amazon were sponsoring my wedding, but they're not. I'm sponsoring Amazon with my wedding. So uh, a lot of the wedding stuff will be purchased through Amazon. And one of the items was the guest book. And this guest book is very nice. And it's by Christian Art Gifts. And this exquisitely designed wedding guest book celebrates love and marriage in style. Specifically selected scripture verses add to the appeal of this book. And there is ample space for guests to write memorable or favorite memories, impressions, or advice for the newlyweds. So I'm looking forward to opening this up on the day that I get married uh, or the day before so I can put it out there so people can sign it. And if you would like to uh, donate to my registry, um, I totally welcome it. I have a link. I will give it in the description below. You don't have to, but it's there. Um, I am still picking random things to put on the Amazon list. Uh, you have the option of Amazon or Walmart. Um, but uh, if you do either, they will be shipped to me and it'll be awesome and easy. I've got this package. And uh, let's dig in. So I really, really, really like Amazon. Uh, I started shopping on Amazon in 2012. Um, and that, I think the first thing I bought actually was textbooks for school. So Amazon, believe it or not, was a book company. They sold books. Um, and the idea was it was going to be A to Z. 
so you had, you know, like a book, A to Z. Uh, you'll get everything that you ever could want online and uh, more so than in the bookstores. And for me, I was interested in buying their books related, you know, for school, uh, textbooks, and ebooks when that was available, Kindle. So that was my first experience with Amazon. I got a student membership and then I decided to buy a printer for school. And then from then on, I trusted them because that was the first time buying anything on the internet. Um, books was, I was okay with books for whatever reason. And then I moved on to the printer and that was a big purchase for me at the time. I think it was a couple hundred dollars for the printer. It was one of those fancy uh, scanning everything. I just wanted to scan for school and everything. Uh, so I bought that, I had a good experience. Uh, I signed up for the student uh, prime membership. It was affordable. And before you knew it, I was buying everything on Amazon. And here I am in 2020 buying a lot from Amazon. So I was kind of kidding earlier that, um, you know, Jeff Bezos' house is sponsored by me. You know, I got at least a tile or something in there. Um, but I was actually kind of serious too because I did spend, like, there's like my everyday budget and then there's like my Amazon like what I've spent on Amazon it's crazy and so for those who buy from Amazon you understand a lot of stuff you you go there first before you go anywhere else uh, okay so what do we have here we have a photo backdrop and I will show you a screenshot of it because I'm not gonna open all these I'm sorry uh, just because it'll make a big mess and uh, well, maybe, maybe I'll open it. Couldn't resist, it just looked good, too good. Smells like material. Always have to give it a sniff, you know what I mean? So, and uh, yeah, it's gonna have this nice backdrop. It's gonna look really, really nice. Put it behind the cake, uh, something, so when you take pictures of it, there's you know just a nice little backdrop. I think we're gonna like it a lot. Set that aside for now. What else we got in here? We got, ooh, I don't even know what this is. Oh, a picture frame in gold. Uh, so like I was saying, sometimes you uh, really like fund Amazon. And uh, I mean, you know, you just end up buying everything from Amazon. You buy, first you buy, you know, products you know, like Canon, and then you buy products you don't know, and then you buy products you need, and then you pro buy products that Amazon makes. And uh, that happens pretty quick uh, because you end up just loving Amazon. So really, this story is about how we ended up buying a bunch of random things on Amazon. You know, it starts off as a book company. You trust them with buying your textbooks, you get an Amazon membership, you like the free shipping, no one else does it. You buy a printer, it works, you're like, wow, I spent a lot of money on a printer and it actually got to me, it's not fake. Uh, and before you know it, you're buying everything and then you're buying Amazon branded products themselves. So that is the true success of Amazon. I mean, you can literally buy anything you want on Amazon. You can buy Apple products, uh, like this Apple Watch. You can buy all kinds of stuff and uh, you know, and then you start buying stuff for your wedding. So uh, let's let's dig into that. Let's, um, you know, you buy Brita water filters because you can. Uh, yeah. Okay. Now this is a big heavy box. Let's um, see if I can get to it. Um, okay. This box is marked heavy. Oh. Oh boy. Oh. It's a heavy box. <clears throat> okay. So this box here, uh, we pre-opened it because uh, save time. This box here has a lot of stuff in it and my other camera can't even get all of it. So let's put it back on the floor and let's dig out, dig out of it. Oh, <clears throat> okay. Oops. So, uh, I would like to tell you that, you know, I bought a bunch of random things in this box, uh, but I didn't put that back. 
Uh, instead, I bought very practical items like, uh, well, like this. It's a very practical item. Uh, they're candles. And there you are. Got some candles. And the reason I got candles here, they're fake candles, is that uh, for your wedding, you need decorations. And this was a very budget-friendly and useful decoration. Electric candles, you pull the tab here on the bottom and uh, turn them on and they flicker like a candle. It looks really good, but it's not gonna set anything on fire, which is very nice, very child-friendly. So I can put that in a way you can see that. There you go, got a flickering candle. Uh, maybe I should turn off the lights, but then it'll mess up all my lighting. See, flickers, very nice. And yeah, I'm looking forward to using this as decorations. Uh, might put it in little cups, we don't know, like glass cups. Um, and uh, it'll, look, it'll make a very nice decorative piece for the wedding. So how many of you are following Mr. Beast? I know I've been following him for a little bit. Um, I've been really impressed with his videos. <laughs> That's kind of what inspired this one. Uh, of course, not everyone can be Mr. Beast. There is only one Mr. Beast. Um, this is a disposable, uh, I guess, plates and napkins, forks, and you know all the things you need to eat with. Uh, it's disposable. Looks good. Looks very nice. Um, I'm not going to open, like I said, most of these products I'm not going to open on camera because we're saving them for the big day. But I figured, hey, since you know they came in Amazon boxes, why don't we unbox them and see what's in here? Um, so we got three of these uh, for the guests. Uh, felt like that was a good, solid number. And um, let's see what else we got in here. Uh, oh, yeah. This is the bouquet, and uh, I'm gonna let Kara do the honors of opening this, but it um, comes in this nice little box, dusty rose. I'll show you some screenshots of it. Um, looks really, really nice. We're looking forward to opening this, but this is just a nice touch to have in this box. I always liked boxes like this. Plain, with a top, a bow, very nice box. What is this? Uh, not entirely sure what this is. I think I want to open it up just to find out what it is. Um, where's my knife? It's getting kind of messy over here. I told you it's going to be a big unboxing video. So I don't think you'll, you know, are you entertained, my friend? Are you entertained? I mean, I told you it's going to be an, a big unboxing video. Whoa, we're dropping stuff. That's how big this is. Uh, and someone please in the audience share this with Jeff Bezos. Uh, I want him to at least get a chuckle out of it. Uh, bonus points if you can get him to comment and just say hi. Uh, that'd be hilarious. But uh, man, big, big fan, Jeff, big fan. This service that you invented, I use it like all the time. So uh, let's see here. Oh, I know what this is. This is a card box so you can put your wedding invitations in. I think I have to build that. So let's see if I can get a better picture of that. So it's this. Uh, I have to assemble it, but basically you put your, uh, like I guess when people bring gifts, you know, gift cards or whatever kind of cards they want to put, they can drop it in here, you put a lock on it so no one's tampering with it. It's just a nice little place for all the cards to go and no one has to monitor it, it's pretty nice. So, pretty cool, pretty cool. I just saw that, it was just kind of an extra thing I bought with the wedding guest book. Uh, this is some kind of artificial flowers because you need to have flowers and uh, we're doing all artificial so the environment can be happy um, that we uh, bought fake stuff. So, oh wow, that's nice. Look at that. 
I'm not sure if those are roses or not, but yeah, those are going to be nice. Yeah, so we have all kinds of uh, plant life that's not real. So that way I could buy it early. Just, you know, we didn't know what was going to happen with COVID. And uh, we were prepared to decorate. So this is cool. And these are all things you can buy on Amazon. Now, um, you know, like I said earlier, Walmart has its own service, and I'm excited about it. But I think Amazon has a special place uh, among this, so uh, I don't think I'm. I don't think it's a competition between the two. I know that they they might be competing or between each other, but I don't think it's really a competition. I think it's like Amazon has its place. I have live streaming, and uh, there's a lot of stuff bundled, a lot of value. Uh, but and I'm able to get all kinds of stuff. And as you can see, I like buy everything on Amazon. I mean. I did see that Walmart started this whole uh, Walmart card, 5% uh, five cash back, just like Amazon. I think that's a pretty good deal. Uh, but, whoa, what is this? All right. Oh, I remember what this is. This is, um, this is like fake eucalyptus or some kind of plant. And, Put it across the tables. Uh, you can decorate all kinds of things with it. So we got a lot of bags of that. All kinds of stuff. Fun. And we got our, I guess these are what, boutonnieres? Got those. Uh, yeah, all this Amazon. So, okay, let's see what else we got going on. I think there's one other box that hasn't been opened. Okay, we'll put this back. So, uh, okay, all right, one more box. Oh yeah, it's a big box. Does it matter which side I open from? Maybe, yes, no, maybe so. Gonna go with this side. All right, let's see, got a knife, where'd my knife go? So much stuff on the table, I don't know where the knife is. Okay, let's open this up. Okay. Okay. We're opening this up. I don't even have enough space on the camera to see it. Oh, looky here. Okay, you're going to want to see this. Okay, we'll just put this down. And we'll just start pulling out stuff out of the box. Oh, hold up. Okay, so, oh, okay, not entirely sure what this is. Oh, I know what this is. Okay, okay, these are disposable uh, champagne flutes that have glitter on them. This is gonna be fun. Very, very nice. This is gonna be exciting. Very nice. Okay, we'll put that back. So, all right. So, I take it we have two boxes of that. We got some more flowers for decoration. So, this is the floral collection of boxes, apparently, from the wedding uh, cake knives because. Uh, you need to cut cake, and this will do the trick. So, hand wash only, good to know. So you might want to wash it before the wedding. It's clean. Okay, what else we got in here? Ooh, ooh, what is this? Oh man. Interesting. I don't even remember what this is. So I'm kind of, I thought, I think I know what's in here, but I was kind of wondering if that other box over there was what I was thinking. So I'm actually not sure what all these boxes are. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is what I thought it was. So that other box must be something else. Um, 
So, look at that. So this is a ring box. And the purpose of this is to put the two rings side by side. The ring bearer will have, this, have the rings in here. And they'll have it closed and they'll walk down with the rings and I'm not concerned about them falling out into the grass or something. So um, keep the box closed and the rings will make it. So that's why I got this. This is pretty nice. So you can put the two rings together. We won't lose them. Just don't lose this box. We're golden. So moving on. Okay, what do we also got here? Let's do this one. Okay, I lost a camera. So let's uh, see what this is. What is this? Ooh. More flowers. Oh, I know what this is. This was taking a while. These are the corsages. Very nice. Get a nice good look at that. So, yeah. So basically, I hope you learned something from this video that you can get pretty much anything on Amazon and you can get wedding decor on Amazon. And it's nice because you can get it early. You can store it away. Whoops. Uh, you can store it away. Hopefully you don't lose it or break it. But um, you can be prepared even during COVID. So uh, the real reason why we're doing all this is that we didn't know what would be available, what would be going on. Let's buy it. We don't know if we're going to have to postpone it. So we have all this stuff ready to go. You can see the prices on Amazon. Follow camelcamelcamel.com and uh, see when the best time to buy is and then buy it then and um, get some good stuff. Oh, what is this? Oh, we're not done yet. Hold up. Gold pen. So this pen, let's open it up. And we just lost our second camera, so I don't think we'll be able to see it. But you get this little lovely pen. Oh, and it's got ink and everything else. It says, thank you. Ooh, nice friend. Okay. Uh, ooh, let's see this. Ooh. Look at this pen. Oh, yeah. Well, when I unbox this or open this pen, I'll be able to put it in here. This is what they'll sign the wedding guest book with. Very nice, very stylish. Man, I just am blown away by all the different products that are on Amazon and that somebody made their livelihood by coming up with each of these, these things. I mean, someone makes pins, gold pins. Um, this is not actual gold. This is just gold plated or gold looking, but um, there's a business for that. So if you're out there, um, oops, I probably should put this back in the proper packaging. Uh, if you're out there and you have a product idea and you have a, you know, some knack on how to 3D print or you, you know, make cards or handmade this or that or whatever, kind of like Etsy, uh, there's a place for you on Amazon and there's a customer for you, just like me, uh, who will probably buy it. Um, so if you're out there and you're looking for something to do, some way to earn an income, a living, hey, Amazon is a good place to put your products because someone will buy them. Someone like me, uh, someone like uh, many of our viewers. And uh, in this case, I'm buying stuff for the wedding. So I didn't think I'd be ever buying flowers, particularly artificial flowers, but uh, we are because we need it to decorate. So that concludes my video. Thanks for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I really tried to make this video as fun as possible. Uh, whoa, dropping stuff. I mean, whoa, we're really dropping stuff. I know that uh, PlayStation 5 is coming out, whoops. So, um, I know that PlayStation 5 is coming out and uh, many of you have asked me if I'm gonna get the new console. Well, I just got this one in February, so 
Uh, I don't know. It depends. It depends. So if you would like me to get PlayStation 5, unbox it, have a good old time with it, uh, you can donate in the link below. I'm going to include a link uh, if you want to support the channel, if you want me to you know, buy certain things and kind of demo it. I would appreciate the support right now. I'm just kind of doing this based on things I'm actually buying for a purpose. So like that PlayStation, I really did buy because I wanted a PlayStation. So uh, PS5, I hear great things about it. I hear about great things about the new Xbox, but I'm just, I can't, you know, this was kind of showy, but this was meant to, for the wedding. So uh, that was kind of already planned for, but uh, PlayStation 5s and different things, I will have to, get uh, contributors. So uh, ways you can help me right now is sharing this video with friends, getting that like button smashed, commenting down below. Hey, if you can get Jeff Bezos to comment, <laughs> share it where he sees it. At least I get 30 seconds of fame with him. That'd be awesome. Uh, I know he's pretty busy. Uh, and if you could uh, subscribe to the channel. Uh, I'm trying to reach 1,000 subscribers. Once I've reached 1,000, I will be eligible for YouTube partnership, which is basically you can put ads in your videos and eventually monetize them. And that will help me jumpstart to getting all cool kinds of products and stuff. And for the record, these boxes are empty. These are from previous unboxing videos. So if you want to see the unboxing video of this, you can see this is an early one. Uh, you can watch that. I have a link below. Uh, it's in my channel. I've never done an unboxing video on the Echo Dot, but let me just say, if you're thinking about getting an Echo Dot, it's a great product. I have them like literally everywhere. They're awesome. So uh, I also have a Google Home. So shout out to Google Home. Uh, those are good too. Um, and uh, that's really it. So until next time, thanks for watching.